Hey, what's going on, guys? I'm Sully Pones, and welcome back to Let's Play Mario and Luigi Paper Jam. In the last episode, we learned how to do papercraft battles with Mario, Luigi, and Paper Mario. So today, I'm going to be exploring the desert as it's a brand new area in the game that we just made it to. So before we begin, guys, please do me a huge favor and leave a like on this video. As you can see, these spinies are going crazy, man, and I have to battle them. I have to. There's no exception. It's a new area, and they're new enemies, so we have to battle them. Can they stop? It's weird, because sometimes, as you can see, I'm dashing, right? But then I'm able to jump with them, rather than have them actually, like, dash on the ground. It's weird. I don't know why they don't dash. Maybe it's only like that when we're chasing someone down. But for the most part, you can just jump like that. This is really nice. I actually like this. I don't know why I don't use it more in the game often. But anyways, let's go ahead and battle this Spiny, because he's a new enemy. And uh, we'll see what they're all about. How, how, how they hold up in comparison to other Spinies in different games. Um, they're actually level 5, so they're about the same level I am in the game, and it's weird, look at this now, see, Mario is now starting off the battle, so does that mean Mario has more speed than Paper Mario? Probably so. Um, let's actually see if Luigi's gonna be the one doing the attacking next, oopsie daisy, okay, whoa, whoa, they do 10 damage? What? Are you kidding me? Oh, okay, we really need to make sure that they don't hit us, and Paper Mario is getting more than one hit in, which is nice. You know, it looks like you're having a tough time using that hammer. Want to go over how to use it to defend yourself? No. No! I hit no. Oh my gosh, Starlo. I'm pretty sure I know how to defend myself. As soon as they're coming to attack you, you just hold down your button and that's it. Does she really want me to do it now? What is she making me do? Okay, yes, I got the hang of it. No, I don't want to practice some more. I didn't even want to practice to begin with, stupid Starlo. Jeez, wasting my time since 1991. That's how long she's been around. But she's never been in any games. But she's been around for that. I'm just kidding. I don't know why I'm saying things like this. Wow, you're a wizard with that thing. Nicely done. I told you. See, I didn't need any help from you, Starlo. I just know exactly how to do it. And I forgot Paper Mario's hammer attack is like that. Considering that he has copy flowers on him. Excellent paper hammer attack. I could get an excellent one with Lil Mario. Lil Mario. That's his new name. They should have a kid and name it Lamario or Muigi. Muigi. Paper Mario leveled up to level 5. Not bad. One more level and then this guy will have a new rank. So will Mario and Luigi. I think actually Mario and Luigi are both level 5. Let me check. I haven't checked in a minute. Let's see. Level 5, level 5, and level 5. So pretty good, I have to say. Um, I don't know why Luigi always has less EXP than Mario. But I guess that's just how it always is going to be like. Uh, but anyways, now that we are done with that and we had one battle here, we can actually go find Nabbit. Because if you guys remember, in the last episode, we actually saw Nabbit here in the desert. Um, and he ran away with all of our bro attacks. So it's up to us now to, s to chase him down and get our bro attacks back. What's up, Nabbit? We cornered you, man. There's nowhere to run except in this huge desert. All right, we got this. You bros got this? Nope. Once again, he fooled you, and something fell out of his bag. Now, the real question is, do you give it back to the burglar, or do you keep it? You got a new bro attack, Drill Shell. Go to the battle guide to see how it works, or practice using it. Alright, let's go ahead and actually try it out right now. Goodness, that's a bro's attack that Nabbit dropped. He must have stolen it from Peach's castle. Well, no crap, dude. Of course he did. If we catch him, I'll bet we'll recover even more bro attacks. We gotta get to Bowser's castle eventually, but for now, let's keep the heat on Nabbit. Okay, so we're currently going to, to, to chase down Nabbit for some bro attacks, but I want to actually test out the one that I just got. So I think they're going to be attacks and then drill shell. So press B to launch and then press A to drill down uh, when you're directly over an enemy. Once you connect, press B as many times as possible to deal the most damage. Sounds pretty straightforward. Um, let's try it out though. So you press B and then A over the enemy. Like that. No, not like that. <laughs> Definitely not like that because we didn't do any drilling. So hit B. And then Mario will go up over the enemy. Drill. And then hit B as many times as possible to get A. Excellent. Yo, this attack looks like it actually could do some serious damage. Probably more damage than any of the attacks that we have. So I'm going to actually try it out on another enemy just to see what it does because I'm very intrigued right now. And uh, I'm not necessarily sure if this is a bro attack for Luigi or Mario, 
I'm assuming it, I mean, I feel like it's a bro attack for Luigi. It just seems like that. It fits him more rather than Mario. So uh, hopefully I'm right, because that would be nice if I actually uh, was right. Yo, what up, Nabby Nab? I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you. Woo! -hoo. Oh, God. No, 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 no. Not today. We got to catch Nabby Nab. Come here, Nabbit. Slow down, little man. Slow down, you little thief. Wow, really? He waited his way all the way here. Didn't even give me the op. What? He's behind me, dude. Hey, Nabbit. Are you ready to give up that sack yet? It doesn't look like it. He's trying to uh, to make his... Is he trying to head into Bowser's castle right now? I don't know. But I didn't even get to explore the last area that well. Probably not that much going on here, to be honest. Besides just Spinies and Spikies and whatever other Mario names that I forget in this area are. That's it. That's all there is. And what are these panels, man? I see them everywhere. I've seen these and, like, little baby ones like these. And I don't know what they're for, to be honest. But hopefully we can figure that out soon. Because I am getting a little too intrigued to figure what those things are out. And I'm actually doing this battle right now just to test out um, the bros attack uh, with Mario and Luigi. We can do a hammer, I guess, with these guys. And I say these guys because there's six of them. I don't consider Paper Mario his own individual entity. I like to think of him as more than just a thing. Okay, so it looks like Mario is the one that doesn't actually have the bros attack. So it's, in fact, uh, given to Luigi like I had predicted. Pretty nice, you know, I have to say. I'm very... What? I thought you were going to attack me with your... Um, just jump on me or something. But, yeah, let's go ahead and do the drill shell on this Spidey that's level 5. All right, B... Bounce A over the enemy and then hit B as many times as possible seeing how much damage we can deal 30 freaking points Wowzers that is more damage than any attack I have ever done in this game has ever done on an enemy so far So now I think I find my new favorite bros attack as cheap as that sounds Those 30 damage guys. I think I know what I'm gonna be using on the next boss. Oh This is exciting man and since we're still chasing Nabbit down, I think we might actually be able to get our hands on more bros attacks, hopefully today. Because it wouldn't make sense having us chase Nabbit down if that's the only thing we're going to get. Unless he has something to do with the story, then in which case that would make sense. Um, but yeah, uh, new area, so I really don't even know where to begin looking for things. There's a crack in this wallpaper Mario can enter in. Is it just an item? Yep, just coins. Nothing really to do with the story. Um, optional thing to do, I guess. So, where did Nabbit go? Where is he? I can't see him on the map. I can see... Okay, there it is. That probably must be him. Whoa, this place is huge. I really don't even know where to begin. Okay, Paper Mario, Paper Mario, Mario, Luigi, Paper. Paper, Paper, Mario, Luigi, Paper. Was that it? Yeah! 10 coins. What? So, they make you memorize that and all they give you is 10 coins. Dude, 10 coins is nothing when you really think about it. It's absolutely nothing. It does nothing for you. You can't get anything with 10 coins. You'd think they'd give you a little more than just that, you know, considering that you are memorizing certain things. Hey, it's Nabbit again. We found him. Hey, can you just slow down, buddy, and give me that sack? I think it's uh, a little... Whoa. Kamek is here, of course. <laughs> Trying to save the princesses, are you? Well, it won't be so easy this time. Why is that, you say? Oh, because you're placing platforms everywhere. I got you, man. Well, they don't call me Jumpman for no reason. So, uh, you're kind of just wasting your time and energy. You like? I just whipped those up in my spare time. What can I say? I'm a crafty henchman. Yeah! Plus, you've got two armies of Bowser minions to contend with. It's going to be a long, hard slog to Bowser's castle. In fact, I doubt you'd even make it there if you spent the rest of your life trying. That's kind of a bold statement to say, Kamek. Your laugh is terribly annoying. At least it's not as bad as yours. Hey, they used my paper joke. Well, not really. I guess it doesn't really make sense, because it's not... It's out of context, so I guess it really doesn't make any sense. But dang, what did they do? They really actually blocked... Whoa, I can break... I can move that all right let me uh hit, hit hit what okay i guess you can't hit the big one down so we gotta find a new way to make our way through and i'm gonna say it's probably gonna be going back to the beginning all the way like this just like that man see this is probably yep i freaking called it this is the way to uh to get to wherever it is we're trying to get to oh stop 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 there we go okay and Woohoo! Whee! 
I forgot they can flutter too. Woo! Just like that. Makes it a lot easier than um, to simultaneously jump by uh, clicking A, B, and uh, Y. All one after the other. It's not that it's hard to do, it's just um, this guarantees you more of a landing rather than one of the bros accidentally falling. Hey, it's a switch. Oh, this reminds me. You know that hammer you've got? Yeah. You can use it by switching the action icon. To do so, press L or R. Yeah, we know that, man. We know that. They should just have a game mode where they ask you if you've played a Mario and Luigi game before. And if you don't want any random interruptions for tutorials. I mean, I can't really complain because the tutorials in this game aren't nearly as bad as the ones in uh, Dream Team. So, definitely that's a plus side. That's an up. We've had like barely any tutorial. Well, we've had a couple tutorials. But it's not, like I said, nearly as bad as the ones in Dream Team. Um... We have some cacti over here, uh, I guess. That's a, that's a yeah. That's I don't know what that is. is. That a form of a cactus? I don't know my cacti's guys, so I couldn't really tell you. Um, but where are we headed to now? Where the heck did Nabbit go? How did he get so far, dude? There's no way he was able to cover that much ground in such a short amount of time, dude. You need to chill, Spiky. Chillax, bro. Not today. We're not doing this right now. There's um, a lack of two little hut back there, but I can't actually see it from here. So what if it's not actually in this little part of the screen? What if it's in a different area that I can't access yet because I can't see it? That would make sense. But where's Nabbit, dude? Where did he go? Where did he go with my stuff? Oh, another switch. Let's hit this one and see what happens. Oh, there you are, Nabbit. Wait, he just jacked my hammer. He jacked Paper Mario's hammer. All right, so now we have to catch Nabbit. Nabbit stole our hammers. Go get him back. So he stole more than one hammer then. Not just... Yep, I don't have any hammers with any of the bros. Come back here, you fool. Give me my hammer. That's one of them down. Paper Mario's hammer. I don't think I'll ever have anything as lucky as that where I can just instantly nab him in less than like five seconds. Look at that, because now he's going to start running really far. Okay, here we go. Okay, 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 Nabbit, Nabbit, just chill, buddy. Nabbit, just chill. Just chill. Chill, buddy, it's okay. Don't need to be scared, man. Don't need to be scared, dude. It's okay, man. Just chill, there we go. And I got one of my hammers back, so so far we have two. We got Luigi's hammer back. The only hammer missing currently right now is Mario's hammer. Okay, not bad. Oh, snap, he's going to run all the way over to these platforms. How did I not figure this one out? I kind of expected it. Oh, so now I'm being able to slide. So I guess my theory was right, where I said that if um, if you're like in a situation where you have to chase one of these guys down, like whether it be Nabbit or a Toad, that's when they're actually going to let you uh, click A, B, or Y in order to do your slide. But uh, besides that, whenever you're doing this on your own time, you're not going to get that slide effect. Instead, you'll get a, uh, a jump with uh, the bros. That's it, so, instead of doing this constantly, you can just click A, B, X, or, or A, B, or Y. Oh, gosh. Okay. I need to get this guy. Just slow down, Nabbit! Come on, you're being annoying right now. You're literally being a nuisance. Nobody likes doing this, man. Oh, come on, I had him there. I literally had him there. There we go! Nice, not bad. I think uh, doing the X flutter with these guys actually really helps out a lot. Because I feel like they gain a little bit of speed while they do it. And then they're always much closer to Nabbit. Because that's when I only get like the red exclamation marks and that's it. But we got our hammer back. And we got another bros attack, which I predicted. A rocket blast. Yeah, we're going to go ahead and see how this attack works. Just because... Um, I'm assuming they give us one for Luigi and then this one's going to be for Mario. It just makes more sense. Plus rocket attack, that sounds like... I guess it sounds like something for both of the bros. I guess it could work either way. And there is Nabbit once again ditching us. Hey, at least they put us back here. Instead of having us to make us walk all the way through here. Just to get back to the Switch. So that was kind of um. I keep forgetting that uh, this game has like little mini games within the game. So that thing that we just did with Nabbit was like a little segment that we couldn't actually skip. Or just run away from. It was like a game mode in the game if that makes sense. I don't know how to explain it. It's just like, if you play games, you'll understand what I mean. Like, it just 
takes you away from the story to put you in this mini game that you have to beat in order to progress with the story, if that makes sense. And that's just exactly what happened with Nabbit and the same thing that we get with the toad sections when we have to search for paper toads. But once again, whoa, whoa, we're almost there, guys, to Bowser's castle. The desert wasn't as big as I thought it would be. And there it is, Bowser's beautiful castle, man. I absolutely love Bowser's Castle, and this place is littered with more Paper Mario related things. Um, I don't know. I don't know how I feel about it, to be honest. I think it's nice, but it, it kind of makes me uh, think of, of Paper Mario Sticker Star. Like, I, I get that vibe, like, a lot when I play this game. Okay, grab these coins, and then go talk to our little buddy Nabbit. Come here, little dude. Come here, little guy. Dude, what are you doing, man? Are you gonna do this all the way to Bowser's castle? Just give me my bros attacks so I can beat Bowser once and for all. Yo, what's happening? What's happening? Oh my gosh! It is the Pokies. The regular Pokey from my world and the Pokey from the Paper Mario world. Of course, man. Of course they would do that to me. Minding my own business and that's what they do. I got sand in my mouth. Gross. It's all good. It's better than being eaten by them. I guess we have to go back the way we came in. What a pain. All right, stand up. Let's go. Come on, Luigi. Time to go. Let's go, man. All right. Um, wait a second. Uh, maybe I got to break this. Wait, what? Oh, okay. I guess I had to hit the hammer with, uh, or hit this with the hammer. Well, too bad we can't actually break those blocks. It's because... Doesn't look like our hammer is strong enough to do it, so this might be where the bros come up with something new to weasel their way out. I'm going to predict it's going to be the dig attack, where we could dig our way underneath things, like rocks, maybe. You want to dig, Luigi, so we could collect uh, some beans? Maybe? Maybe not. Yeah, I mean, we've done it before. How did you guys forget? Uh-oh. Stop it. Chill. You're scaring me, man. You're going to cause an earthquake. Just tell me what it is you guys plan on doing. They're very slow. Okay, Paper Mario, I don't know what you're saying. Give me something to work on. Oh. Maybe it's not the uh, drill attack. Because if it were, I feel like it would have been a much simple, simpler explanation than that. Jeez, can't speak today. Did you guys just think up of a new move? That's what it looked like to me. If you ever want to practice it, just talk to me. I'll help you out. Okay, so we learned the trio hammer. So press A, B, and Y in that order. A, B, Y. So I hit my hammer, Luigi hits my hammer with his hammer, and Paper Mario hits Luigi's hammer, hitting my hammer with his hammer. That's hammerception. Wowzers, trio hammer, pack. Wowzer, trio. Wowzer, trio hammer, packs quite a punch. Yeah, it does. Though, do you suppose it does anything besides break stuff? Oh, well, that would explain what those panels are for. Like, what about using it to flip stuff over? I never thought of it. It actually didn't occur to me at all. By the way, you can always check out the guide for information about how the trio hammer or practice using it. All right, I kind of figured that because you just told me. So, A, okay, so A, B, Y, and there you go. We just made some trees. That's it, little bushes. Cool, or little flowers, whatever those are. What about this? Does this mean it's gonna be a platform? A, B, Y, bam! 50 coins! Nice. Okay, so where am I right now? I don't remember this bridge at all being here. Oh, I'm in a different place. You know what these things are? I bet you anything, um, Hold on, let me just collect the coins. I bet you anything these things are going to be for Paper Mario just to spin across and then boom, latch onto the next one. It's going to be it's, it's probably going to be like a slingshot. I'm pretty sure. I could just see it like being like that. Cuz it looks like it's a, a a thing like created to maneuver Paper Mario around. Okay. Okay, so A B Y and break that block. And we got another one up mushroom. It's nice how they're actually putting a lot of like free items around this area so right now like I'm not spending any coins the only like thing I'm buying is just like gear for the bros um but where the heck am I supposed to go now I'm so confused okay okay I think I figured it out this is it yep yep this is it back to the hammer boom the motion and the lotion in the basket all right let's do this one um let's flip this over I don't even know what the point of flipping these things over are 
Yeah, I don't know what the point of these are. I feel like I'm doing it wrong. Like, I feel like I'm not supposed to just do one at a time. Because it comes out like that. And it's not my fault, I swear. I mean, I guess it is my fault, but... I'm still not used to doing this at all. Um, and unfortunately, the platforms are all gone here, so we can't climb that the old-fashioned way. We gotta find a different route to take. And this is going to be it. This is the route, my friends. Alright, let's break... Let's break some stuff down. Boom shakalaka. Boom shakalaka. There we go. Not bad. Switch back. Um, is this a thing that I can break with the trio hammer? Nope. Doesn't look like it. Alright, that's all good. Anything else that I can use my trio hammer to break? Maybe like those cactus? Nope. Doesn't look like it. Okay. A, B, Y. And then... A, B, Y. I'm actually kind of nervous to go up. Uh, ooh, what is this? A war pipe. Nice. Okay. A, B, Y. There we go. Hey, coins came out of it. Not bad. All right. I wonder if I click this, if I'll do it again. If this will raise A, B, Y. Nope. That doesn't actually push it out. But there's a war pipe there. I don't know what it is for. I'm kind of nervous, though, because I'm actually worried that we're going to be battling the pokies is uh, another boss and I don't know if that's going to be true or not but I just it, I feel like it would make perfect sense to battle them as a like a next boss but I don't see them so I think we're good to hopefully oh I see you guys no what are you doing what are you doing you idiots why did you do that to me why were they just waiting there I bet you Kamek gave him the order to wait there for us to cross the bridge so they wouldn't let us through Oh, come on now! Way late again? How are we ever going to make it to Bowser's castle at this rate? We're not. I guess Kamek was right. Where are we? So this is the Doop Doop Dunes Grotto. Has some nice music. It's like a remix of like the underground theme in Mario. Alright, everybody! Up, up, up! Let's put on our thinking caps, fellas. Those two clearly aren't going to let us pass without a fight. So we're going to have to bring the fight to them. But they're way up there and we're down here. If only we had a way to jump really high. Well, mule it over. In the meantime, let's explore this area for anything that might help us get back on track. Alright, sounds good, Starlo. Anyways, guys, that is going to be it for this episode. Thank goodness it wasn't a boss battle, but according to Starlo, it might seem like there's going to be a boss battle coming up. So, I'm actually going to end off the episode here, and in the next episode, we're going to be exploring the Dune Dune Grotto, uh, and hopefully making our way out of here just so we can get back on track to making our way to Bowser's Castle. So, thank you guys all so much for watching. If you enjoyed, leave a like, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye. <laughs>